What's up, everyone? So, got Jack with me. I got quite a wobble to the front end. I'll show you the tire here in about two minutes because I'm going to, Tipsy and I are going to be uh, taking this off. But I'll show you what my handlebars have been doing for a while. I'll show you the old tire. Um, obviously, when I jack it up, I'm going to make sure there's no bearings or anything wrong. So, that'll be step one before I go and put a $200 tire on the front end. Okay, now if I let go, hopefully you guys can see. See how my handlebars just go crazy? It doesn't matter how fast you're going. You let go of your handlebars. So I let go of the, and I, as you guys can see. That's just, and I can even feel it going around corners. Now once I get to work, I'll show you what the front tire looks like. So I'm not sure if you can tell here guys, you should be able to. But this side, like just this strip here, these are wearing so thin. You got lots of tread from like here over and then lots of tread from there over. But this, and that's what's giving the wobble wobble. We're gonna jack it up with the jack. Take the tire off as long as it's sturdy enough. And uh, Tipsy's going to uh, take the tire over and get it changed up for me. Obviously, because this will be on jack. So we got the tire off, guys. Tire's off. The bearing seems super tight. Let's look at that mark again. See how. Oh, it's all weather cracked, too. If you look really close. Hold on, focus. Yeah, it was time for a new tire anyways. You show them the new tire? And then this is the new one, Tour Master. Uh, whatever you call it. Shinniko. 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 F230. 150, 80. That's the new tire. Going up a sized old tire was 140, 140. 80 17 and now we're going with a uh, 150 80 17 oh yeah guys let's get this tire on what? looks like you almost lost it <laughs> uh, tire? Uh. yeah it was like this i was hauling though don't forget to take off your little tag yeah look at that nice Nice new. I almost dropped my spikes out. Shanigan tire. <laughs> I'd call it Shanigan. And boom, tire's back installed. The new one, anyways. Yeah, looks good. Like I said, the old one was a 140. This is a 150. It fills up that front fender nice. And then for next spring, there's a bunch of stuff I'm going to be doing to the bike over winter, but next spring, I'm going to get this junky thingy off which it, it's done me good nothing wrong with that get that off and I'm going to put the same, few now. The same tire the Shinko or whatever 230 touring edition on the back oh yeah guys so let's see if I can take my hands off now with a new tire on or is it steering column the, the column bearings which we tested and they seem okay. I don't know. We're going to find out. Okay, guys. So we got the tire, new tire put on. And look, taking the hands off, it doesn't shake anymore. Oh, I'm so glad. So, yes. It wasn't the bearings. It was 100%. The tire was so out of freaking balance that it just, yeah, because I can drive, ride, I can ride with no hands now. Should have put some gloves on today. It's a little chilly out, but. Definitely feels so much better going around corners. Doesn't feel like the tires are always slipping up. So 
Oh yeah, which is nice. Oh, I'm so happy I can drive with no hands. Drive, drive, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. You don't even know. Haven't been able to do that forever. There were so many weights on it before. The handlebars have always had the wiggle like that. Yeah, so the handlebars have always wiggled like that. I just have never, you know, really thought anything about it. I'm just like, ah, everything seems to work. I might as well, well I'm good. And then the other day, I just looked at my tire. Ah, uh, see, woo -hoo. I just looked at my tire. And I'm like, oh, that doesn't even, like, I didn't even touch it. I looked at it and I'm like, that doesn't look right. So I'm like, oh, I better fix that. And here we go. Yep. Good old new tire on the Shinko 230 Touring or whatever it is. I already like it. I already notice a huge difference, even though it's just right here and here. But, anyways, guys, that'll be it for this time. Have a great day. Stay tipsy, stay tripping, and stay redneck. Cheers, y'all.